Space.com. Rich Bonaduce with Space.com in Promontory, Utah at the ATK testing site to see a test of the Gem 60 rocket booster. So we just witnessed the Gem 60 motor being tested and uh, you get the initial flash as the uh, rocket motor lit off and then about a second and a half later you know you get the, the reverberation and the pressure waves coming off of that. It's very very impressive. This solid rocket motor is a strap-on booster for the Delta IV central core. It gives it greater uh, launch capability, allows it to lift a heavier payload, and yet not have to go to a larger liquid rocket engine like on the Delta IV Heavy. So, you know, to get that medium plus range of payloads that they need to cover, it's uh, more economical to use this solid rocket motor. Initial indications are that uh, it was very successful, met all of its uh, requirements. The nozzle needs to be uh, taken apart and looked at, make sure that all of the proper margins were maintained and so forth. So a little bit more testing left to do, but all indications are uh, very positive and good, uh, successful test. If you ever get a chance to see a rocket booster being tested, I think that you should, because you actually, when you're here, you get to see it before you hear it about a second or so delay and then you don't just hear it you feel it and you can look down and you can see everyone's pant legs shaking in the in the wake of a rocket like this being tested it's really cool if you can ever check it out please do anyway rich bond did you with space.com in promontory utah space.com